do you know it's been 11 months now? Honestly, it doesn't feel like that at all. But there have, in fact, been that many of these. Next month, we would have officially been doing this for a year. And while it doesn't feel like it, we have that level of progress in the game. It's important to remember that there is a ton to do in this. And also that they've added a load of stuff since we originally started playing. Anyway, I'm getting distracted. Let's start the month. Day 1. I wanted to get that mini quest from last time finished off, but it wasn't possible. Instead, I started a beast one. We got a new structure built, but just the structure. We still have more work to do. Day 3. That work involved picking a load of roses from Beast World and bringing them back to him so we can get them going here. Then we handed a few out and got the quest done. After that we got the mini quest done too, which is nice because that's the last one for us. Day 4. Today was just a grinding day. Oh, and I gave Scramble Coin another go. I'm still not good at it. Day 5. We managed to pick up a new Eric quest, which wasn't really my goal, but I'll take it. We're basically picking up a lot of stuff to build a map area in his home, and we achieved that. Day 6. I managed to pick up the final Simba quest, which is nice. What is less helpful is the fact that we need Dreamlight fruit, and we've already harvested and sold it for the day. Oops. Day 8. Well, we could get some today, and we're off to try and get some more trees, or plant some more trees, but... In terms of what we need to collect, it's going to take longer than just today. Day 9. And today just ended up being a bit of a grinding day because, once again, there was no fruit. That's annoying. Day 10. Today was lucky, though. We managed to get our quest done and Simba's quest done. Then we get to add some more quests because there's been an update, which sends us to the Monsters Inc. world. We successfully disguise ourselves as a monster and help them to get the place up and running again. But we're not done yet. Day 11. Today we're searching kids' bedrooms for hints on how to make them laugh. It's a little weird, but I, I, I guess it's okay in, in the very specific context. <laughs> Once we help them harvest some energy, we finally get them both on the island. The downside, though, is there are two more quest lines to do. <laughs> Day 12. We're not going to worry about that one right now because we've got a Woody quest to do. He needs us to help rebuild the car, which we do. <laughs> and then we go and hunt down some aliens. There's going to be many of these quests because this is something we've got to do for a while. Day 13. It can take a couple of days for them to come through, so in the meanwhile we will start a Mike quest. It's to try and make him feel more at home, but the thing he asked for, I mean, he asked for a lot. Take it easy, dude. Day 14. Of course we're going to get that done, and there's some more aliens to hunt down, so I do that as well. Day 15. Today we spend some of it helping Sully trying to put together a movie night, although it is quickly clear we will not be able to finish that, and we also get some more alien toys. Day 16. We get Scully's TV made before we attend, and that's the first Sully mission done. I keep calling him Scully, Sully. Day 17. No time to waste because we already have our second Mike quest, and he wants... Disgusting cologne. I don't get it either. We have to bury a carp and wait for it to rot before getting some other ingredients like soil. Right. Day 18. We continue working for Mike, which means whole food and stuff like that. I don't get it either. We get it done and we start another study one. This one will be slow though, but it's fine. Day 19. Today we help Ursula make a perfume before helping Donald clear the beach and allow him to take all the credit. And then, boom, that's also the study quest done. This was a lot quicker than intended. Day 20. I got a bit sick of that alien toy quest being outstanding, so I went out of my way to go and find that last bastard, and well, I did it. Number one done. Day 21. This one was just a grinding day, though I haven't been able to say that much this month. Day 22 was too, so we're going to skip that. Day 23. We picked up another alien hunting quest and did half of it. We'll get the other half eventually, but we have to wait a couple of days for them to respawn. In the meanwhile, we do a Mike quest to help him do a comedy night. This one, thankfully, was an easy quest. Day 24. Another necessary but ultimately skippable grinding day. Day 25. Today, though, we got those last toys, and that's the Buzz Lightyear quest done. There is one more coming, but we're done with it for the moment. Day 26. Today we do another quest for Sully, helping him to connect with Penelope through the power of video games. The 11 o'clock was a failure, the arcade machine less so. Day 27. Another grinding day. Yippee! <laughs> no. Day 28. 
Remember I said we were done with alien collecting quests for now? Not anymore. We won't deal with it yet though because it's Easter. We have some Easter quests to do for Wally and some eggs to collect, things to make and so on. I missed these challenges last year because I started pretty much just after them, but I won't do it this time. Day 29. Today was another egg hunting day, so I guess it's a grinding day, but it's a different kind of grinding day. Day 30. Aside from egg grinding, I also go and start the buzz quest and collect half of the alien toys. As always, the other half will take a few days to spawn in. Day 31. Today was mostly egg grinding and regular grinding. I need a certain number of eggs to do everything. It's actually quite a few, but we have until April 17th to get them all. So we have time. And that's the month. It doesn't really feel like this month we accomplished anything major, but honestly it should. Because we had very few skippable grinding days. There was some solid process. We finished Minnie and Simba's questline entirely. We got Mike and Sully onto the island and we pushed through a lot of stuff. And we also made some good progress with other things, other questlines like Woody, for example, or Buzz. Next month, well, I might try and do something special considering it's the year. But regardless, I'll see you then.